sometimes what happens is the cornea becomes too diseased to be treated only by medications it can happen when somebody has a very severe infection on the cornea or it can happen when your cornea is bulging too much which is called a keratoconus in advanced stages or you can have a scar in front of the cornea which will prevent any light to go inside the cornea it is like changing the glass of your watch if the glass is scratchy you cannot see the time perfectly so what do you do you change the glass of your watch same way we remove the cornea take it a cornea from somebody else a cadaver and you put the cornea in your eye see most cornea transplantations have good results if the selection of donor and recipient is done well you have to look at this in this way the success rate of cornea transplantation is better than most of other solid organ transplants however it is not as simple as a cataract surgery or some other procedure so you have to have pre operative and post operative precautions plus a long term medications have to be given to patients in general i would say that in certain diseases even corneal transplantation can give you 80 to 90% success rate corneal transplantation initially was done as a n block thing if you have any problem in any layer of the cornea we used to remove the full cornea and put in a new cornea recently we have come up with something which is called as component corneal transplantation let's say for example your eye has a disease in the lower part of the or the inner part of the cornea we don't need to change the full cornea we just remove that part and remove and put in a new part which matches that particular part so it is like a targeted treatment now which we call as component corneal cell surgery it is the treatment options available is something called as deep anterior lamellar keratoplasty and something called as dsec in which you can take a specific part out of the cornea and replace that by another specific part which is healthy and disease free fortunately there has been good work on corneal transplantation especially in the this part of the world and the developing world and people know that if there is a problem with the cornea it can be changed however what i will suggest is that if you have been diagnosed as a problem which is not treated with medicines in the cornea and you are seeking an advice for corneal transplantation you should get it done by somebody who is very experienced and has done multiple corneal transplantations before 